Hi there, welcome at gns3vault.com. I'm going to show you how to solve the OSPF stub area lab. So let's have a look what we have here. Two routers, two areas. Let's take a look at the goals that we have. First of all we're going to configure OSPF on both routers. So let's start with doing that. And the loopback should be in area 0 and the fast ethernet interface in area 1. There we go. Let's wait till the adjacency comes up. Takes a little while. And there we go. Let's take a look at the routing table. And we can see the loopback of the other side. There we go. So my OSPF is running with two different areas. Um, so we got full connectivity. Now what are we going to do? Um, I am going to create some extra loopback interfaces on router Algrim. There we go, four extra loopbacks. And now I'm going to advertise these into OSPF, but we are not allowed to use the network command. So one other way of doing this is using a redistribution. For example, redistributing the connected uh, subnets so I want all the uh, directly connected interfaces and uh, the subnets if you do not specify the subnet commands then it will um, uh, OSPF will behave uh, classful so you want to make sure you type in the subnet command I could use a route map to only specify the four loopbacks <coughs> That would be a better solution, but this is the easy way. And what we can see now is, you see the four networks, the four loopbacks that we advertised. Of course they're shown uh, up as E2, because it's an external route, uh, we redistributed it into OSPF. So we did this, that's all good. Um, okay, we did take a look at the routing table. We can see all the four networks. Now what are we going to do? We're going to change the area type of area 1. Um, so instead of four networks, we only see one default route. So let's have a look.
We're going to turn it into a stub area. And here we go, because it's a stub area now, um, you only see a default route from now on. And you won't see the four prefixes that we did before. And of course let's try this. Well, let's see if we can still ping the, the loopbacks. <coughs> I'll just try one of them. And there we go. So we achieved all of the goals and that's uh, pretty much all there is to this uh, lab. Thank you for watching and till next time.